Hello everybody, uh, just came to tell you guys I have like good news. Um, I'm in a, I'm in the front yard, so hopefully people doesn't like bother me or anything like that. Uh, but yeah, like I have like good news and basically I now have, I now have an interview Yay. <clears throat> but there's a bad news about it. Uh, it's next Sunday. <laughs> Gotta wait another week. That means if I get hired, I won't get my paycheck till October. So that means I have to pay a devil. God. Hopefully I make more than 600 on my paycheck, but which is less likely because I just started. But yeah, we'll, we'll see what happens. And uh, there's, there's also something else I want to talk about. Uh, it, it happened yesterday. When I was eating, I don't know what it was, lunch or dinner, I'm not sure, they don't, they ate at like three or four and some shit, I don't know, like, I have like a, I, I used to have a perfectly well balanced meal schedule, like in the morning I would eat breakfast, there's nothing to eat for breakfast here, and in lunch, I eat lunch at like one o'clock, and whenever I'm eating like, like frozen food, I cook it in the microwave oven for like 30 minutes, and I cook, put it in there like at 12:30. Like, like, like I said, I have like a schedule for eating food. And for dinner, it's usually at like five. It's it's five, but it's only because like we had to go to sleep early. And um, thing is about lunch, if you're eating lunch, don't eat, don't eat a lot of food, you gotta, you had to save your uh, appetite for uh, dinner. Cause like if you eat too much lunch, f uh, food at lunch, you're just not gonna, uh, you know, you're just not gonna like feel hungry for dinner. But yeah, that's like, that's what I used to have, I used to have that, but it's like, Jose, my uh, Jose, my friend, he does not know what to eat. This is his house too, and it's like I think his appetite is like all mixed up, so he only eats with this whenever his parents eat, and like that's like normal to him now because he's he's like he's like used to it, and. I I really I really hate that honestly because he only eats like once a day and yet this kid is so fat. He's fat. He doesn't eat a lot, but yet he is fat. How how is that possible? I'll tell you how that's possible. I believe it's because it has something to do with your enzymes. It's supposed to digest your food, right? Every time this dude eats, he says he feels something in his throat and he spits it out. Spits it out. Get serious, bruh. That enzyme, it's not like boogers or anything. You can't have that like all the time. And if that's like a condition that he has, then why isn't he taking medicine? Because he doesn't have a condition. Dude just spits like all over like every time. He only does it whenever he gets outside. Like he, like he, he gack his throat and then just spits out the saliva. It's like just swallow. That's what you feel in the back of your throat. It's not always mucus or whatever. So that's why I believe that he doesn't... Like why he's fat, you know what I mean? His life would be like so much easier if... He has like... He basically had like enough money to like... Rent an apartment and... We, we want to like rent an apartment where because like it's quicker that way we can rent an apartment like for a year or two and then we're out we'll find a 
we'll probably find a house or whatever. Now, right now, I am currently just going to uh, pick up my friend Jose. I'm not picking him up. I just like, I just like being outdoors. I just like walking. Not to mention, it's cold as Santa's ball sack in the house. Very cold. So. Ah, uh, fuck. Yeah, I'm gonna pick him up. I'm gonna get a new phone. Of course, when I have money and shit. But when I, when I start getting paid, I'm buying my own groceries. We're buying a fridge in the room. Never going out. At all. I think, I think my only exit outside of a house is going to be through the window that we have. I honestly have no idea what I'm going to do about, like, getting a car. It's just, getting a car is just not really going to interest me much. If I get a car, I'm just going to use it for work and shit. You know, I, I, I think I think I'd rather just... You know, get like delivery for my groceries or shit like that, you know. I, I don't know, it's just getting a car just does not interest me much. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know what's wrong with me. That's just how I am. Just how I am. I, I, I think Jose's bus dropped him off at like. Man, you guys can barely see me, bro. I think Jose's bus just basically drops him off at Booker. It's like the back of Booker, like where the buses drop off elementary kids. You know? Oh, I see him. I see him. I can't... I can't flip the camera. So... If I had to, if I want to like flip the camera to back of the phone, I had to turn it out like, like this. There are kids screaming, bro. How are they supposed to be in elementary school? There are like houses we can just get. Like we just got to find houses like in a neighborhood. Probably rent them out and shit. Because the maximum... Time I'm staying at his house, at like at Jose's house, it's like a year. After a year, we're like gonna be moving out. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, yeah, right there. Yeah. Shit. Oh, I thought I stopped recording. Shit.